morning we've had a bit of snow last night and what a nightmare i've had bringing isaac to the farm so i had to get him in through the front door and then to get him out now i'm having to get some warm water and uh, pour it over the door so that the uh, the door will open that's how cold it is so em's already feeding round on the tm andy's about somewhere i've seen some dust yeah it's cold Morning Emily! Cold isn't it? Are you are? Your toes are cold. Yeah. Wiggle them, just wiggle them. Wiggle, wiggle, wiggle. So I've got the meal in the bucket. M's on the gates for me. We'll get this uh, cows fed. Andy's on the 130 there. I think he's just cutting the bands off the bale. Oh, he's there, look. It's looking very nice today. I don't know if you can see, but there's steam coming off the meal. It shows how it warms up because it's got the energy in it. It heats up overnight. So we like try and keep it as fresh as possible. Andy's backing in. Putting another bale in, we am. I'm just auguring it out into the trough slab. Everybody happy. So I've got the spreader bale now on the TM and we're gonna do one of the pens where it's easier to get this machine in rather than and this straw board. That's the plan. Here we go. Pulling it out. It's quite good this spreader bale. It doesn't chop the straw up quite as much, but um, it's just not as handy for like getting into pens and stuff. Um, doesn't throw the straw as far as the, the teagle does. So literally every pen you would have to drive in, uh, uh, our farm anyway, to do uh, to do all the strawing up. Oh, I still feel a bit rough, you know. It's really spreading this barley, yeah, barley straw though. Like I said the other day, they're quite light bales. We just couldn't get the weight into them. Um, believe it or not, it was too hot and dry this summer, so. You know, it does get hot here in, uh, in South Yorkshire. Well, it looks nice. Em's just sending them down this end. All running in, skipping and jumping. It looks like we're having problems with the nine meter again. Oh no. Em's gonna do a mix with Merlo, she's gonna have a little go on it. Yeah, it looks like you're getting 13 mils under. Yeah, it's on a start. Well, we'll see if the Merlo will start. Should do. No, it won't because it hasn't got a key in it. We'll give it a go now we've got the key, eh? Oh, you're joking me. What's up with this then? Uh oh, yep, here we go, we've got lights. Turn the ignition key to off. Okay, turn it back on. I've got my foot on the brake. There we go. No, this one starts anyway. Oh, full moon. Um. Mate, this, that red thing there, that's your part brake, yeah, so put, turn that to the other way, turn that's off. And then, uh, either you can use that to go forward and backwards, or you can use the, there's like a lever on back, further up. That's it, you just push that forward and it being forward. Yeah, <coughs> and then you just touch the accelerator to go forward. And then if you let off your accelerator it stops yeah yeah just be careful with bucket it's a bit like brutal and um andy says just be careful when you're tipping it in or something because 
He says it's a bit different to how others tip in. You work it out though. Right, have fun. There we go, she's on it. She's now a Merlot driver. In the snow. The drone has landed, and what do you say, Em? Andy cut his finger. He's cut his finger while the drone was over the top I of him. I think he sort of blamed it on the landing. Oh, well, it's the drone's fault that he cut his finger. We'll find out in a minute. Is it cut bad? He's got plaster on it. Has he? It's blood for Andy. Oh, he don't like blood, does he? It's like, literally, might faint at any point. Come on then, how's your finger? And what's happened to it? Did the drone do it? Yeah, the blade. I thought it was. Yeah, I just sliced my thumb off. What, with your knife? <laughs> I don't know. <laughs> Something somewhere. Were you under pressure with the drone? Is that what it was? Mm. And you were like... Just rushing around. <laughs> so the band wouldn't come out, would it? It's because I'm... Did you put your finger on the band? Was that? It was on... oh, I I'm like I'm omnipresent sure. now, you know, now that the drone's here. It's like, I'm always uh, oh, the boss from hell. <laughs> Could I have the drone up? So Watching Andy cut his finger. He's got a microphone on it, he's going to be shouting. He's going to bring a gun in. Yeah. <laughs> Probably be my dad, though. <laughs> hey, that's not a bad idea, that, Em, is it? I wasn't recommending it. A little speak, a little Bluetooth speaker on the bottom. Oi, Em. Andy. Some like preset little things. No. No? You wouldn't hear it, would you? <laughs> <laughs> you wouldn't look at it. I'd give it in fact, cab, would you? <laughs> Some air horns on it. Air horns on a drone. Anyway, what do you think to the drone music that I use <laughs> in it? Because I saw somebody commented saying they didn't like it. So I've not got much options, to be honest, in the app that I use to, to use free music. And that one's called like. Go cowboy or something, and I thought, well, it's got cows in it, and it's a bit like cowboyish, so I put that on. Well, let, what, let me know. Let me know what you think.
Right, so it's time for Merlo to go home. Just getting the bits in the bucket. We would have given it a good blast off and an, a clean, but it, Ollie says it never gets mucky. Well, well they do. Everything's frozen up there. Yeah, I think if it was uh, if it was a lot cheaper than the JCB, you never know. We might look at a Merlot. It's not it's not out of the way. It's not a bad machine. So we've had it three days. I've only just noticed this. So this is to do with cab suspension. I thought, oh, is it does cab roll back on itself or something? Oh, it's a suspension. So we just had a load of barley um, turn up. It's going to fetch another one, I think, in a minute. So Dan's just been to chat with us about the Merlot uh, Agriscope. So if anybody needs to have a look at a Merlot, give uh, give Dan a call and he'll uh, he'll sort you out. So Dan's just gone now, and the Merlot's gone as well. Um, so I don't know. Yeah, I thought it was quite. It was a decent machine. I think you just need time on it to like get used to that sort of way of driving. Because the gearbox is completely different and I wasn't used to it. It was, <coughs> able, like. wasn't it? it was very able to do the job. Yeah, yeah, it had the power, it had the speed. The hydraulics were the same. Like nothing much changes. If it was like a few thousand less than the JCB, would I have one? Don't know, maybe. Yeah. So I have to see when we come to thinking about swapping it. See what Dan can come up with if he can sharpen his pencil and get it nice and cheap. So me, Andy and Em are now getting cattle out and clicking them. I put everything in there. And it usually has to it, but I feel like absolute dog crap. Um, yeah, we're just going to get these ready for next week. So we got queues to bring in barley now. We're getting cattle out, so we've, uh, we've not seen these guys. Em's going to weigh them in. I'm just going to push the barley that we've got there up with the nine meter. You up? So here we go, pushing the barley up. So we'll get all this nice and neatly pushed up and then we'll get the loads brought in and tipped off. So we've got a tractor load coming in on the case, a 165 CBX. Postal service is on strike today, but not not the guys delivering barley. And as well as that turning up, but the barley is. Now we've got a big beast going in, a proper trailer full. So just in the lorry now, just sweeping the last few bits out um, that are stuck at the front. It's great to see a lorry driver that actually gets in there and gets it done. Uh, the amount that you'd see trying to and smash backwards on the lorry trying to get it out when really all it just needs is like two minutes for a sweeping brush. There's like 50 kilos in there, something like that. Um, so yeah, well done. There we go, all clean. So he's getting onto the weigh bridge, we'll just get him weighed off now and then I'll get his load pushed up. Look like there's a bit of skidding then getting on. Still icy and cold here in South Yorkshire, I tell you that. Right, so I'll jump back on the beast and get pushing. So we've now got a fair pile of barley back in the shed. Which is good because we're going to have to be milling tomorrow, I think. So Andy and Em are giving this one a clip. I think it's quite liking it. His tongue will go in a minute ago. In a nice scrap. We've got another lorry in the yard now, a load of Trafford Gold. So this must be to get us over at Christmas. I'm sure he'll be alright. Yeah, you can hear there's loads of stones on the floor. Yeah, there's plenty of grip in here. Getting it back to now. 
So he's just going to get that tipped off for us now. So Andy's just sorting out, putting some hay on the path. And I better just tidy this traffic gold up. Get it all nice and neat, pat it down like a sun castle. A sand castle, not a sand castle. So getting it all nicely patted down. If you see this stuff steaming as well, because um, yeah, the process of doing it is uh, it makes it warm. So it's a warm product when it arrives to us. It's all nicely battered down. So we're on now, just feeding out. Make sure everywhere's got plenty of feed. Because when it's cold like this, they will be eating. Try and keep warm, aren't they? What are you doing here? For the you're off work again. I thought you were supposed to do your CPC. I've done my CPC. It's 10 to 5. I know, I've done it. I've been here at 3 o'clock. You're on I've been home, I've been to the toilet, come back. Did you get your shower? Did you get your shower? I did the, the pool. <laughs> <laughs> I, I don't, There's uh, a story behind that, guys, I'll tell you one day. Put me gun up. Ready. Ready. Oh, you're going to do some rats, are you? Yeah. Oh, well done. Thank you. Rat time. Fuck you. Good. <laughs> right. Not me at oh, it's good. I like it. I, I like it. it. Representing. Perfect. Best you ever give me this. <laughs> this and this and asshole you give me. Is that what it is? <laughs> always ever give me this and asshole. What about beers? I'll give you beers? Yeah, many. <laughs> These guys are all looking happy. So these are the ones we fetched in from the field. Chewing down on the meal. Check this out, eh? Hey, Andy's cleaning the windows for me! Thanks, Andy! Hi. Superstar, eh? Didn't even ask him to. I say cleaning them for me because I will be on the straw blow tomorrow because Andy's off down Devon! Yeah. It's got too cold for him up north, so he's got to go back down south where it might be warmer weather. Is it going to be warm down there? I'll ask him in a minute. Andy's giving it a freshen up in here. Freshen up, freshen yeah, up! <laughs> Are you going to spread it on my feet? That's on your feet, are they that bad? No, I thought that's what you'd done. <laughs> you think that bad, Joe? Yeah, they probably are, to be honest. These wellies are worn you out. Can you even smell it? I can't smell anything. Mm -hmm. Can't smell anything at all. So isn't it going to be warm in Devon anyway? Probably not. No. Uh, yeah, well. You get the wind chill down there, don't you? Do you? Yeah. Oh, next at sea, it'd be lovely and warm. Yeah, I can smell it a little bit. Sanitizer what is it again? Well, it says. HD car care. Yeah. It is strong, isn't it? You can smell it. It's nice. It's good. Yeah, it's good. So you Thanks for that. Sent it to Andy. <laughs> you didn't get none, did you? What? Cleaning products. Hey, how should we get one? I want my hat. <laughs> it's I big mid cat. Don't well, forget Charlotte. Like I want me to get one. She does. She has a shower. Asha, 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 oh, me and Charlotte like this. <laughs> right, anyway, guys, if you've liked today's video, please press the like button and subscribe if you've not already. Oh, let me know which... Uh, so I've put two songs in today. Oh. Well, not songs, but, you know, music to the, to the things. So let me know which one you like first, uh, best. So the first one is the cowboy one, and the second one's some kind of, like, I don't know, Summer Beach or can something, I think it's called. Can you download songs? You can, you can use, like... You can use like songs that are in the charts, but it's like yeah. you got to pay so much per video. Yeah. What are you so doing? you know, it's like it's, what are you doing today, it's, it's expensive. Oh. Um, so yeah, thanks for watching, guys. We will see you tomorrow. Big mix here. M's here. I'm here. Andy's not, but um, we'll just have to survive without him. Let's clean my windows. Mm. What dilly dilly. I knew he said dilly dilly. Bye, guys. Oh, M's wavered. We're just looking now at the fairy lights. It's long, isn't it? We've got to try it. See how see how bright they are, like. But can I just say something? Go on then. There's a set of fairies trying to put them on. Two fairies. <laughs> fairy Andy and Fairy Joe. Oh, I don't know. So yeah, we're just yeah. looking at these, but I need to. Try it with some batteries, see how bright they are. Thanks for watching, guys. Bye.